Hey everyone, Joe from BearsLeak.com. I have a 26 year old Billy Goat Leaf Vac that I've always had issues with every year when I'd um, bring it out of its long winter hibernation uh, not being used and I'd go to uh, fire it up. It wouldn't fire up. Always had to take the carburetor apart and clean everything out. So let's see, I, I left it I, last year I ran Bears True Blue fuel system conditioner through it uh, all season and uh, I even left the gasoline that was in it I left it over the winter didn't put any fuel stabilizer in it or anything so um, after a full season of using Bears True Blue fuel system conditioner I just want to see if uh, if it fires up without me having to pull the carbs apart and clean it so let's go so my garage is a mess. I got uh, leaves all over the ground that I need to pick up. And I would have gotten it out earlier before the video, the leaf blower that is. But I wanted to show you that it's still buried from the winter here. So um, there it is. <laughs> you can see it behind all this junk I have in my garage. So I am uh, going to dig it out, and um, we'll see what happens. Stay tuned. Okay, so uh, there it is, a Billy Goat leaf blower all dug out. By the way, these things are great. I don't know if uh, everybody's heard of them, but um, and there's other companies that make a similar product, but Billy Goat's, I think, the original. Um, they just make cleanup uh, a cinch. Um, like when it comes to leaves and stuff, everything sucks up into this bag and, and, uh, then you, when the bag gets full, just dump it out and mulches it up so you can get a lot in there. Um, and, uh, just saves a lot of bending over and bagging and all that nonsense that you have to go through. Um, but anyway, oh, by the way, uh, it's my son's little old, good old Saturn SL1, um, and uh, baby was saved by Bear's True Blue Head Gasket Sealer. Uh, still running strong. It's got 225,000 miles on it. I think we did the Head Gasket Sealer uh, over 15,000 miles ago. Can't remember the exact amount, but um, stuff is awesome. But we're talking about fuel system conditioner today. So let's check this thing, see if there's any gas in there. Might have to add some. Oh, all right, so it's bone dry. I don't know how that happened. I left it full of gas. So let me go get some gas, and we'll see what happens. So in an effort to show you everything from start to finish, I'm going to get some uh, gas in this thing, and I apologize for the uh, portrait mode of, of the um, camera. It's just the easiest way to record when you're doing it by yourself. I personally prefer landscape when I'm watching videos, so anyway, apologize for that. Let's get some gas in this thing. Okay. Not too fond of these nozzles. Tend to splash all over the place. So I'm going to take that one off. Try to carefully pour it in there like this. I'm going to fill it up because I got a lot of work to do. Hopefully I don't have to take the carburetor apart with all this gas in it and pinch the lines. Come on now. There we go. A little bit of top. A little bit of splash. on there. 
Gonna hit the primer bulb a couple times. That's maybe 10 times since it has, hasn't been used. Now the moment of truth. Let's see, got the bottle up. Okay. Some more prime. Remember, I've never been able to get this started without cleaning the carbs every year. Not having luck now. I was a little skeptical there. I thought maybe my luck did not change. But uh, as you see, I actually just started this sucker. I was pulling there for a while. But I've spent an hour with this thing every year just trying to get it started after a full winter. And I uh, was never able to do it until I cleaned those carbs. So, um, I would say that Bears True Blue fuel system conditioner helped keep this system in good shape. Um, probably had some issues starting it at first because uh, somehow the uh, fuel must have evaporated. Um, it was completely bone dry. So until that fuel worked its way on down to the carbs, um, that must be when it, it decided to turn over. But uh, I'm impressed. So, anyway, um, if you have any, you know, farm equipment um, or your vehicle, this stuff improved my gas mileage in my car tremendously. Um, I mean, four miles to the gallon, to me that's tremendous because uh, I, I drive a lot to get back and forth to work. And uh, four miles to the gallon adds up. So, anyway... Hope you found this video helpful. Um, I give the Bears True Blue fuel system conditioner an A+. And uh, you can get to bearsleak.com and get yourself some. Uh, we have a special up there. Three bottles, free shipping. Uh, so, anyway, have a good day.